The testing phase of PCB manufacturing is one of the most important stages. Without testing your PCBs, there is a possibility that errors and problems have been overlooked during the production stage. Key factors driving the need for PCB testing and analysis include failure identification, time saving, and cost reduction. The PCB is tested at different stages during the manufacturing process. Sierra provides a certificate for compliance along with a final inspection checklist including dimensional requirements and measurements. Here are a few PCB tests specifically highlighted. PCB testing is performed in multiple phases. The prepreg test provides information on the content of composite and resin, gel time, and resin flow rate. It also provides information on resin quality and grade. Ionic contamination testing can be summarized as an extractive analysis technique that allows the quantitative measurement of ionic contamination on electronic boards. These parameters are determined in purity per official regulations and verify the surface quality. Automated Optical Inspection AOI, is an automated visual inspection of printed circuit boards. Here are a few key parameters determined by AOI. Area defects, component polarity, volume defects, solder bridging, and more. These tests are carried out to verify the components will meet the requirements of the standards. There are several ways by which solderability testing is done but the two most commonly used methods are the dip and look method and the wetting balance analysis. If the board is tested okay, then you are good to go. The cross section or micro section analysis is considered as a destructive analysis to analyze the quality of the manufactured board. These key parameters are determined during the cross section analysis. Start, basic copper thickness, copper plating thickness, etch back dimensions, total copper thickness, solder plating thickness, and dielectric thickness. Flying probes can access component pins directly or through automated test point probing. They don't require test points. This improves test coverage over in-circuit tests that use bed of nails. It uses the vias on the board as embedded test points. Therefore, the test points are no longer in action. The scanning electron microscopy energy dispersive x-ray spectroscopy analysis is performed to measure failure related issues of PCBs, assemblies, and electronic components, BGA capacitors, resistors, inductors, connectors, diodes, oscillators, transformers, IC, etc.